Hi, it's Tara from Jilabay Design Studio, and today I'm going to show you how to use Silhouette Studio to open up a watercolor file for printing for sublimation. It's not going to be able to be cut because watercolor files have transparency in them. So if you don't do these settings, you're going to hang Silhouette. So what you need to do is under Edit, Preferences, Import, under PNG here, this auto trace needs to be deselected as mine is right here. It defaults to be checked. You do not want it checked. This will basically tell Silhouette, do not trace this image. You're just importing it as a PNG. Since it's for sublimation, you're not cutting it. Anyways, you do not want to trace it. So I will show you how this works. I will open up my frequent flyer design, which is a watercolor popular design right now. It's a very large file. And you will see very quickly Silhouette has no issues opening this file with Auto Trace disabled. Now I will show you with, oops, I don't want to do that. I just want to get rid of this. Yeah, I don't want this file. I'm now going to set it to be Auto Trace on to show you what will happen if you do it with it Auto Trace on. So now I'm going to open the exact same file and I'm going to hang Silhouette. Silhouette is trying to trace every single little line and all the transparencies of that giant file. If you wait here till tomorrow, maybe it might show up, but it probably won't. It's just going to crash silhouette. Those type of files are not meant for cutting anyway. You print them and you manually cut them with your own scissors or you just sublimate them, which don't need to be cut anyway. So this is why if you have problems with a watercolor file hanging, it's because the auto trace.